Well, hey guys, Jeff here. Welcome back to the channel. You know, it's getting springtime, and if you are guys who have pools, it's time to start doing your maintenance and getting them ready to fire up and enjoy for the season. Here, we're no exception, and I'm starting to do that. One of the things I'm going to do today is I have a salt system type pool, and uh, you have a chlorine generator, and that tends to get calcium buildup on it, and there's a way to clean and take care of all of that, and I always do mine in the beginning part of the season. So guys, if you'd like to see that done, check this out. I'll take you through it step by step. You know me guys, come on, let's go get busy. Okay guys, this is the chlorine generator. I have turned power off. One of the ways you absolutely know is I have no light indications. I had lights on before, killed the circuit breaker, don't have anything now. If you are concerned, one other thing you can do, will not hurt a thing, is you can unplug the wires to it. And now you know for, for sure you have no power going to your chlorine generator. This unscrews from both ends. I'm actually gonna put uh, a dummy sleeve in because while I'm, let, I'm gonna let this soak quite a while and while I'm doing that I want to be circulating some water here shortly so I'm just gonna put the dummy. Okay also I've got all of the water circulation off so the only thing I'm gonna have is once I get this pop loose I will have a little bit of water drain but it won't be much. Okay guys I want to show you what this looks like inside before I uh, do the treatment on it. Now this is not bad I've seen them a lot worse but I mean it definitely needs to be done. So I hope the camera will see down in there. Let me get really close in. And if you look, if you see, uh, let's see here. If you see that all that white, that is actually calcium on top of the electrodes. And let me spin it around this way. And you can definitely see that those electrodes going across there, that's calcium buildup. So anyway, I'll show you how to do the kit and put the chemical in. It's a cell cleaner and we'll show you what, uh, how to do the process and then we'll obviously let you see what it looks like when we're done. All right, this is a kit that you get from Pentair and basically it's just a cap that fits onto the end. Now I wanna put it on this end because I wanna make sure all of this is submerged for sure up in that. So all you do is make sure you have your O-ring set and you just spin this up on nice and snug. And I've only got a bucket here just to help balance it. And so I'm going to set it in like this. And this is a product you get from BioGuard as well. And again, I'm, I'm not trying to be a salesman for BioGuard, but these are just good products. This is called uh, from Saltscapes, and it is a cell cleaner. And what you do is you pour this over in there, and you just walk away and let it do its work. Okay guys, fast forward to late in the day, it's been quite a few hours and the uh, chlorine generator uh, has been soaking in that salt cell cleaner uh, and it has turned out beautiful. Let me get over here and show you and I'm going to see if I can get the camera. If you look down, you can see the electrodes are just clean as a pin. And let me show you the other side, remember how it had all that calcium buildup. And so this dude is all serviced and in great shape just clean as it can be and all shiny like new and it's ready to go re to be reinstalled and go back in service so let me just reverse the process when you put this in you want to make sure you take the note it's got the word flow with an arrow that's the way the water flows through mine runs this way so you want to make sure you make a note of that Uh, last thing to do is just obviously turn the power back on and with the green lights we've got uh, we're good here and this is normal during boot up it's just doing a computer internal check and then this will stabilize and it'll go either green or red uh, should be will go green because our salt levels are normal well guys once again just servicing the chlorine generator this is the product that I use the cell cleaner uh, it's not too awful expensive uh, something you should do at least once a year 
I think that's their recommendations. I do mine obviously in the beginning of the season. So uh, when I need to call on it to generate a lot of chlorine, it's gonna be in great shape and ready to really get the, the system up and the chems going good. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Again, remember here at Project Next One, there's always one more. So guys, we'll have uh, more videos coming. And guys, be sure to check out the end screens. I'll throw them up here. It's a video from uh, doing uh, how to remove stains out of your pool. It's a really cool step-by-step -step with all the different chemicals of what it takes to get the uh, metal deposits out of your liner and get it out of your system. Anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. Y'all take care and we'll catch you later.